Let's face it, the mechanics of sex can feel like a bit of a mystery. Many of us go through life without fully understanding the intricate processes that make sexual function possible. This lack of knowledge can lead to confusion, misconceptions, and even anxiety about our own bodies. But understanding how our bodies work, especially when it comes to something as important as sexual function, can be incredibly empowering. Knowledge is power, and when we take the time to learn about our own anatomy, we gain a sense of control and confidence that can enhance our overall well-being. Whether you're a young man just starting to explore his sexuality, or someone who's been around the block a few times, a deeper understanding of penile erection and ejaculation can lead to a more fulfilling and enjoyable sex life. It's not just about the physical act, it's about the connection, the intimacy, and the shared experience with a partner. Knowing how these processes work allows us to better understand our own bodies and what feels good. It helps us communicate more effectively with our partners, leading to a more satisfying and harmonious sexual relationship. When we know what to expect and how to respond, we can fully immerse ourselves in the moment without unnecessary worries or distractions. It also helps us identify potential issues and seek help when needed. Recognizing the signs of common problems like erectile dysfunction or premature ejaculation can prompt us to seek medical advice sooner rather than later, leading to better outcomes and less stress. After all, sexual health is an integral part of overall well-being, and feeling confident and comfortable in our own skin is essential for a happy and healthy life. When we prioritize our sexual health, we are also taking steps to improve our mental and emotional health, creating a positive feedback loop that benefits every aspect of our lives. This journey of understanding begins with the basics. How does an erection even happen? It's a complex process that involves the brain, nerves, blood vessels, and hormones all working together in harmony. Let's delve into the fascinating world of blood flow, nerves, and neurotransmitters to unravel the mystery of male arousal. By exploring these mechanisms, we can appreciate the incredible complexity and beauty of our bodies and gain a deeper respect for the natural processes that make sexual function possible. So let's embark on this journey of discovery together and unlock the secrets of male sexual health. The journey from a relaxed state to a firm erection is a complex and coordinated dance of signals between the brain, nerves, muscles, and blood vessels. This intricate process is a testament to the body's remarkable ability to synchronize various systems to achieve a single goal. It's a marvel of biological engineering, where every component plays a crucial role in ensuring the desired outcome. It all begins with sexual stimulation, which can be physical, visual, mental, or even olfactory. Each type of stimulation has its unique pathway and impact on the brain, setting off a chain reaction that leads to arousal. Physical touch, for instance, sends direct signals through the nerves, while visual stimuli are processed by the brain's visual cortex. Think of a sensual touch, an alluring image, or even the scent of a loved one. These stimuli are not just random triggers. They are deeply rooted in our biology and psychology. The brain interprets these signals based on past experiences, emotions, and even cultural influences, making the process of arousal a highly personalized experience. These stimuli trigger a cascade of events within the body. The brain, acting as the command center, processes these signals and decides the appropriate response. This decision-making process involves multiple brain regions, including the hypothalamus and the limbic system, which are responsible for regulating emotions and sexual behavior. The brain, upon receiving these signals of arousal, sends messages down the spinal cord to the nerves in the penis. This communication is rapid and precise, ensuring that the body responds almost instantaneously to the stimuli. The spinal cord acts as a highway, transmitting these messages efficiently to the target organs. These nerves then release neurotransmitters, chemical messengers that tell the smooth muscles in the penis to relax. This relaxation is crucial because it allows the blood vessels to dilate, increasing blood flow to the area. The neurotransmitters involved in this process include nitric oxide, which plays a key role in vasodilation. This relaxation is key, as it allows blood to flow more freely into the two chambers of the penis known as the corpora cavernosa. These chambers are like sponges, ready to absorb the increased blood flow. As they fill with blood, they expand, causing the penis to enlarge and become firm. As these chambers fill with blood, the penis begins to expand. This expansion is not just a simple swelling, it involves a complex interplay of pressure and volume. 
The increased blood flow creates pressure within the corpora cavernosa, which in turn compresses the veins that normally allow blood to drain out of the penis and become erect. To maintain the erection, the outflow of blood is temporarily restricted. This restriction is achieved by the contraction of muscles at the base of the penis, which compresses the veins and prevents blood from flowing out. This mechanism ensures that the erection is sustained for the duration of sexual activity, trapping the blood within the corpora cavernosa. This process is a delicate balance, requiring precise coordination between the nervous system and the vascular system. Any disruption in this balance can lead to difficulties in achieving or maintaining an erection, highlighting the complexity of this physiological process. A symphony of signals and responses that culminates in the physical manifestation of arousal. This symphony is a testament to the body's ability to integrate multiple systems and processes seamlessly. From the initial spark of arousal to the final stage of erection, every step is meticulously orchestrated to achieve the desired outcome. Understanding this process not only sheds light on the marvels of human physiology, but also underscores the importance of maintaining overall health and well-being for optimal sexual function. While erection is the first act in this physiological play, ejaculation takes center stage as the climax. The journey from arousal to release is a complex and fascinating process, involving multiple systems working in harmony. Understanding this process can provide deeper insights into male reproductive health and the intricacies of human biology. This process, often experienced as a single event, actually consists of two distinct phases, emission and expulsion. Each phase plays a crucial role in ensuring the successful release of semen. The coordination between these phases is essential for the proper functioning of the male reproductive system. The emission phase marks the point of no return, a build-up to the main event. During this phase, various glands and organs work together to prepare the semen for its journey. The anticipation and preparation during this phase are critical for the subsequent expulsion phase. It's during this phase that semen, the fluid containing sperm, is prepared for its journey out of the body. The preparation involves the mixing of fluids from different glands, each contributing unique components that are vital for the viability and motility of sperm. The prostate gland and seminal vesicles, two key players in the male reproductive system, contract, pushing their fluids into the prostatic urethra. These contractions are rhythmic and coordinated, ensuring that the fluids are mixed thoroughly and efficiently. Imagine these organs as interconnected chambers, each contributing their essential fluids to create the final product semen. The seminal vesicles add a fructose-rich fluid that provides energy for the sperm, while the prostate gland adds a milky fluid that helps to protect and nourish the sperm. This mixture then accumulates in the prostatic urethra, awaiting the signal for expulsion. The accumulation of semen in the prostatic urethra creates a sense of urgency, signaling the body to prepare for the final phase of ejaculation. This pre-ejaculatory fluid, often produced in small amounts during arousal, may contain sperm, emphasizing the importance of safe sex practices. Even though it is produced in smaller quantities, it plays a significant role in lubrication and can still carry sperm, highlighting the need for caution and protection during sexual activity. The nervous system plays a pivotal role in coordinating the entire process of ejaculation. Nerve signals from the brain and spinal cord trigger the contractions of the reproductive organs, ensuring that each phase occurs in the correct sequence. This intricate communication network is essential for the successful release of semen. The expulsion phase is the grand finale, where the accumulated semen is forcefully expelled from the body. This phase involves powerful contractions of the pelvic muscles, propelling the semen through the urethra and out of the body. The force and coordination of these contractions are crucial for the effective release of semen. After ejaculation, the body gradually returns to a relaxed state. The reproductive organs and muscles relax, and the nervous system shifts from a state of arousal to one of rest. This post-ejaculatory relaxation is an important part of the recovery process, allowing the body to reset and prepare for future sexual activity. Understanding the detailed process of ejaculation provides valuable insights into male reproductive health. 
Each phase, from erection to emission to expulsion, plays a critical role in ensuring the successful release of semen. By appreciating the complexity and coordination involved, we can better understand and address issues related to male reproductive health. With the stage set and semen ready, the expulsion phase takes charge with a powerful and dynamic surge. The internal urethral sphincter, a muscular valve, closes tightly, preventing urine from mixing with the semen and ensuring it travels the correct path. Simultaneously, the external urethral sphincter relaxes, opening the gateway for ejaculation. Now, the muscles at the base of the penis, notably the bulbospongiosis and ischiocavernosus muscles, contract rhythmically and forcefully. These contractions create a surge of pressure, propelling the semen through the urethra and out of the penis in a series of powerful spurts. This expulsion phase, often experienced as intensely pleasurable, is the culmination of the entire process. Following ejaculation, the muscles in the penis relax, blood flow returns to normal, and the penis gradually returns to its flaccid state. This marks the end of the ejaculatory cycle.